Welcome to this special edition of News 8 at noon at 11.30. We do begin with breaking news this morning. A three-alarm fire in Rochester on Monroe Avenue and Rosedale Street. You see the image behind me just south of 490 near Cobbs Hill Park. Josh Navarro live at the scene here this morning. Josh, uh, still an active scene. We can see that. What are you seeing? That's right. Good afternoon, Mark. This fire started around 1020 this morning. And as you can take a look behind me, I'm going to get out of the way. As you can see, fire crews are still battling this fire. When we got here about an hour or so ago, we saw a lot of flames uh, being sh uh, shoot up from the, uh, from the roof and a lot of smoke coming out of there. You can still see that there is a significant smoke coming billowing into the air from the rooftop. We spoke to uh, the fire department. They telling us that the fire started on the roof around 1020 this morning. Uh, it's affecting about nine units in this apartment building. Thankfully, no one was injured. We did learn that one firefighter received a minor injury. That was a cut. Um, however, they're still investigating as far as what caused this fire but as you can tell right now it is still an active scene more than 80 firefighters are combating this fire from all over you can see that they're shooting the fire from on top and from the bottom uh, they're trying to put out the hot spots to prevent the fire from spreading onto other homes this entire area right here off Monroe Avenue and Rosedale Street are blocked off uh, for about um, half a mile down Monroe on each side side as they're trying to combat this fire. It is an entirely big scene uh, this afternoon. Uh, we're coming up to this afternoon here in the city of Rochester as firefighters are still trying to knock out this fire. There's a lot of smoke that has been coming and going as they're trying to knock off the fire. Of course, we'll stay on scene and collect any new information and give it to you as soon as we get it. For now, we're live in Rochester. I'm Josh Navarro, News A. Josh, thank you. Intense images from that fire this morning morning. For the latest on this fire, follow News 8 on social media and our website as well.